Hi, it's John. It's what, the 23rd of J June 2015, and I've been thinking about um, working with people that you get on with. You know, if you work, if you if you come across people that you're really getting on with and you're really in kilter with, um, then work can be a sort of pleasure. And, you know, whether that's voluntary work or paid work. But uh, if you get working with people who um, you just aren't seeing eye to eye with and it's always a, a mental battle within you um, whether you want to uh, w whether you want to do what they say or whether you want to argue things out or or whatever um, it becomes you know everything becomes a pain you know and, it, and it's not enjoyable um, and in, in my case I find people that I'm really in kilter with um, quite rare to be honest I, I don't really see eye to eye with very many people at all um, I suppose that's I don't know whether it's just me or whether everybody's like that but you know I work with people um, you know because that's that's life isn't it you, you know you work within the community within the society and um, you just have to keep your your lip buttoned um, and get on with it and uh, make the most of things and and um, you know it's the way of life you know you've got to earn money and you've got to um, work with people um, as they say no man is an island um, but when you come across people who who you really are in kilter with it, it's quite a joy to to, to work with them or have, have, have leisure with them you know even uh, even having leisure with people who you don't really quite see eye to eye with can be a bit of a strain sometimes um, but what is it what is it that makes you see eye to eye with somebody it's, it's very hard to define you know it's not necessarily based on class system or um, education education level uh, it's something else it's something deep in the psyche I mean some people they like to control others so they they like to sort of befriend or meet with people who they can control so you've got the sort of almost a, a sort of meeting of opposites um, people who you know, people who want to be controlled, you know, are attracted to people who want to control. Uh, and then you've got other people who, who who want to rebel against the system. And, um, I don't know, perhaps they're attracted to other people who rebel against the system. But the sort of, the law of attraction, in, in that sense, is, um, is quite a mystery, really. And probably couldn't easily be worked out by social scientists um, but I mean some people there I mean there are degrees of getting on with people aren't there or not getting on with people and some people um, you, you you don't get on with whatsoever you know and then I find Sometimes those people you don't get on with whatsoever, something happens and it turns around and then they become your best friends. You know, my first impressions of people are terrible. I never, never really trust my first impressions to the extent that I may even go the other way and think if there's somebody who I don't appear to like, I think, ah, in the future I may like these people. I'm weird. Right, bye for now.